Hello there and welcome back to my place. Happy Sunday to you all. I hope you all are having a good Sunday this morning or afternoon or wherever time it is where you are today. Um, I'm going to be doing my Sunday Bible reading. I'm going to be reading um, Proverbs chapter 19 today. So let me get on the page and then let me start reading. Actually, I'm already on here. Okay, there we go. Let me get my glasses on. Okay. Proverbs chapter 19. Better is the poor that walk walks beneath in his than he than he that is preserved in his lips and is a fool. Also that the so be without knowledge, it is not good, and he that has that has with his feet sin. The foolishness of man prevent his way and his heart against the Lord. Wealth maketh many friends, but the poor is separated from the na his neighbors. A false witness shall not be unpunished and he shall speak lies shall not be escaped many will entreat the favor of the prince and very and every man in a friend to him that given gifts all the breathing of the poor do hate him how much more do his friends go Far from him. He purged them with words, yet they are want they are wanting to they are waiting wanting to him that he gathers wisdom, loves his own soul. He that keepeth understanding shall find good. A false witness shall not be unpunished, and he sh that speak lies shall be perished. The light is not simply for a fool, much less for a servant to have rules over prince of a man deferred his anger and it is his glory to pass over transpassion the king worth is as a roaring of a lion but his Favor is a dew upon the grass. A full, a foolish son is the chemistry of his father, and the concentration of a wife dropping. House of riches are in are the inheritance of the father, and wife is from the Lord. Into a deep sleep and idle soul shall suffer hunger. He that keeps the commandments keeps his own soul. But he that despises his way shall die. He that has pity upon the poor linked unto the Lord. And that which he that has given will he pay him again. Chasten thy son while there is hope and let not thy so spare for his crying. A man of great worth shall suffer punishment for a, uh, for if he thou delivers him, yet thou must do again. Hear counsel and receive instructions that thou mayest be wise in thy letter end. There are many devices in a man heart. Nevertheless, the counsel of the Lord shall stand. The desire of a man is his kindness, and a poor man is better than a liar. The fear of the Lord tends to life, and he that has it shall abide satisfaction. Satisfy, he shall not be visit with evil. A slothful man hidden his hand in his blood blossom and will not 
so much as bring it to his mouth again. Smite a score and the simple will be aware and reprove once that has understanding and he will understand knowledge. He that wasn't his father and chased away his mother is a son of that cause shame and bright and brightens reproach. Cease thee, my son, to hear the instructions and cast the ear from the word of knowledge and an ungodly witness, judgment, and the mouth of the wicked. Judgments are prepared for sconers and stripes for the back of fools. <clears throat> well, that is Proverbs chapter 19. I appreciate you sticking around listening to it today. I'm going to say a quick prayer, then I'll let you guys go. Dear Heavenly Father, I come to you in prayer. I thank you for another day of life. I thank you for another beautiful day out there. I thank you for the wisdom that you've given me to be able to read this on YouTube, Heavenly Father. I pray and thank you. I pray that um, you help heal your world from all this, all this stuff that's going on, Father. And I just pray for all the people in need of prayer that you help them with their different needs. And I pray this to you this morning. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Well, I hope you all have a good day today. Hope you enjoyed my Bible reading. If you did, please feel free to like, subscribe. I would love to have you join me on my journey if you ain't already. Until the next time, stay safe, stay blessed. Goodbye.